Good afternoon, this is Sharon, Suralea1, and today's video is an entry for a challenge that is being put on by T-Share in Japan, and her name is Sherry, and if you have not checked out her video, you've got to check it out. She lives in Japan and has beautiful items that she's putting as a giveaway for this challenge. So I couldn't pass that up. So I'm going to show you what I did and then I'll tell you what products and that I um, used. So what I've used here is an envelope that is, I believe, and correct me if I'm wrong, this is an envelope that would be used, and I think it goes I don't know which way it goes. If it goes this way, I think it goes this way. And like if you're going to a wedding or occasion where you're going to give money, that you would put the money in this envelope. Now correct me if I'm wrong, Sherry, you would know for sure. So it has this beautiful gold and the um, cherry blossoms. So I didn't want to touch that side because it's so gorgeous. So on the other side, I decorated. And I have some cherry blossoms here. And those were sent to me by Sweet Va. And I'll put her uh, YouTube channel in the description. And Laugh It Out Now gave me these gorgeous beads. I think I only have one piece left and they are just gorgeous and I thought because the paper has some black in it that that would be a, a pretty accent and this paper that I have it's like material and I got this in 2010 from Elaine who on YouTube is Silly Frog Honey Bee and these, I've been hoarding them since July of 2010. I have been hoarding these papers. And this light's too bright, you can't appreciate them. Look at the sparkle in this paper. I hope my camera can give you, but you see that gold, how gorgeous and shiny, and on this one. So I have finally, broken out to use them and Elaine also sent me and I found out from Sherry these are game pieces so this is for a game so I have that one and this one and then I don't know what these are from but they make cute little accents and then I have this big one I think is a coaster so that's a cool piece. And then I have, um, I want to make a little, a miniature gift bag with this. <laughs> it's so cute, this paper, but I've been having all this sit, all this time. And these gorgeous envelopes, coin envelopes. So I guess they use these to give money too. But look how gorgeous. And here's more. This is the size those papers were. Look at that. Isn't this gorgeous? So, yeah, I'm sure you understand why I've been hoarding these, because they're just, like, I've never seen so beautiful. All right, back to the project. So, decorated the front like this. Then I did a tag and put it inside. And so I have a gold braided trim here on the bottom and then this black with an iridescent line on it and then this flower Elaine sent to me she sent me this image and I tried coloring in this was before the craze of Copic so I was worried about the ink but it seems to have dried okay so I used a Copic um, R35 and R29. 
and then in the flowers the I want to call it gold but it's not really it's like a bronze almost I use this uh, Sakura jelly roll you can see it here and in the flowers and then the green I use this um, at you speaker and then for the pink on the butterflies and the cherry blossoms I use this American Crafts glitter pen so it gives it plenty of sparkle hopefully you can see it there you see the sparkle so Besides the sparkle on the paper, I have sparkle on the image. And then on the other side, I have this paper that's years old and it has cherry blossoms. And then I have a stamp set and it has beautiful, and then it has these beautiful birds. And then I sprayed this with the Lindy Stamp Gang glitter spritz. So it's all old sparkle. Can't see it too much here. You can see some of the drops there. See? And then I used um, vintage photo distress ink around the edges of the tag. And I used black soot around the image. So there is my entry. I hope you like it. And I hope others join in on this wonderful challenge. And Sherry, thank you so much for doing this. And I learned about uh, this challenge and about your channel when I saw um, Scrapstress, her video and her entry. That's how I learned about you. So thank you, Rena, for doing that so I could discover this. And thank you, Sherry. And thank you, everybody, for watching. Okay, bye-bye.